All right, part two of my beauty regimen, here's the hair. <laughs> so I get a lot of questions on my hair. Um, number one, I, I get a lot of comments about how thick my hair is. I have a ton of hair and I took off like three quarters of it years ago because there was so much hair, it was so heavy. And so I just had it shaved off. And um, I'm actually due for having my husband shave this down a little closer, but we're also going to New York next week and it's gonna be freezing cold there. So I've been thinking about whether I wanna keep it there or get rid of it. Uh, anyways, I have been uh, doing the same thing for my hair with regards to styling for the last 10 years. Same tool, same spray. And the only thing that's really changed is during COVID, I started uh, dyeing my own hair black and I really love it. And I hadn't dyed it in probably a year and I took a box to it last week. Um, I just love the pop that, you know, everything is bold. And it also, I feel like it makes my hair nice and healthy, shiny, uh, hydrated. So um, I will show you the three tools that I've been using forever. Uh, number one is a paddle brush. This is a brush I use. It's really good for long hair, thick hair. Um, it's nothing fancy. If it breaks, you just go get a new one at CVS or the hair supply store. <laughs> uh, next thing is this. I've been using this since I was in high school. Beyond the Zone Turn Up the Heat Flat Iron Protection because I've always had so much hair, so I've been flat ironing it forever. Maybe it hurts my hair, maybe whatever. It, it works for me. Um, but this stuff is great. It adds shine and it protects the hair from the heat tools. So um, I love that stuff. And then the third thing is my favorite tool ever. I've gotten so many compliments on this tool over the years. Uh, I got it at TJ Maxx. Um, it's a tiny little straightener and it's called Fahrenheit uh, Hot Care Sy Hair Care System. And um, 10 years, been using this thing. And um, one of my coworkers 10 years ago taught me how to use a small flat iron like this um, to curl my hair. And I swear these curls will stay in for like a week. And, um, and it doesn't take very long to do. Okay, so what I do is I split my hair down the middle. I heat up my iron. I take a small piece, smooth it out a bit. Take the iron here, nice up and high. And I start to pull it down, I start to twist. And when it gets down towards the bottom, I start to twist here. Now I missed this piece here, so we'll do this after. And I just hold it for a few seconds and let it go. And I just let it sit there like that. You'll see what we do at the end. This doesn't take long at all. So I just pull it through, wrap it up, done. See that? It's okay that it's smoking. <laughs> all right, next. So you probably have less hair than I do. This doesn't take long at all, maybe five minutes to get all the hair. And you don't have to hold it on here for long, okay? And it's okay too to take different size clumps of hair, you know. But it's not gonna hang with this. <laughs> that piece has a mind of its own. All right. Do do do. Pull. Just keep adding to the back. Now I have coarse hair, so my hair does well when it's styled, it kind of stays. I don't know if fine hair would do quite as well. And I also find that if I just blow it dry and don't flat iron it first, then it holds better than if I were to flat iron it and then curl it, I try not to do that. All right, let's try this side because that was already half my hair, only took two minutes. We got a piece, rogue piece down here. Let's curl it. Just give me a curl. It'll all blend together. No worry. All right, let's start on this side. Same process. So you just clamp it down, start to turn, and you just pull it through. Twist it up. Hold it for a sec. There we go. Good. All right, just a couple more. That's pretty good. I don't need to even brush it. The heat kind of locks it in. <laughs> and I don't even mind that it's raining out today. My hair's still going to stay in. It'll be fine. Good. Just a couple left. Actually, we could probably just do one. And then I'll show you the flip, the final piece. There we go. 
go. So this was a little bit thicker section. So I'm gonna hold it in there for just a little bit longer. Okay. You ready? I'm gonna turn that off and plug it too. So here's how we do it. I don't even use hairspray ever. I just pull it over to one side, run my fingers through. There we go. 